There we go. I've actually turned off the lights on my stand. Hang on, give me a second. And if you are the winning team, you're gonna get some office works vouchers. Woo! Each person from the team. Um Is anyone having any trouble with the Kahoot, or are you just all logging in, I guess? Steph, um, you might need to share your screen for the thing. Yeah, I'll share my screen, yeah. Um, yeah. Tommy Cement. Hello, Wait, we've Tommy's... got one team of United Newbies. <laughs> <laughs> Very cool. United newbies. <laughs> yeah, a lot of people will be hopping in now because Hackerford just made the announcement. Okay, all good. <gasps> Packers. I just want to see like what the best name is since I think Millie and my team had the best hack name. <laughs> Snaggle. We did. We yeah, we did. <laughs> Basically, it was inspired by Stack Overflow, and yeah. and we like food. That's the other <laughs> food. And stuff. United newbies. It's a, oh, that's so cute oh. and awesome that new people are uh, trying it. I've only done one hackathon before. I didn't realize that I've been assigning newbies to one group because I always yeah, had to assign. Based on their skills. So, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I always assign like someone experienced with the newbie so that they can be mentored. Yeah. All right. I'll put the instructions back in again. So as you can see from my screen, what you, one person from each team will actually enter the answers. And you have to join at www.kahoot.it. And put in the game pin eight two seven nine one five three, preferably from some kind of mobile device. Hey everyone, and you in the running gets an office work vouchers for everyone in the team. Woo! Yay! I love the enthusiasm, Alex. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's pronounced Alec, actually. Oh, Alex, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Alec. Pronounce the Milroy. Shut up. Oops. <laughs> just waiting a couple minutes. I'm just going to have a quick sip of tea. Because I'm trying to cut down on the coffee. Out of 23 teams, there's five here. Excellent. Wow. <laughs> uh, speaking of 23 teams, I only see like five interacting anyway <laughs> i think I mean, some had like some issues with discord and then the... interacting yeah. outside of discord yeah, yeah probably okay from what i heard it was more like trying to figure out that you have to rsvp then click attend to get into it ah yeah we're, we're gonna send like an explanation of how to do that part now <laughs> All right, I've been posting instructions in the chat. So who's ready to win some prizes? And show up Me. your technical pro- You. <laughs> well, you're an organizer, excuse me. I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> The organizers can go, go have a team. Yeah. Really, Jackie, you want to go? Oh, PK is also here. Well, oh, yeah, sure, to be why fair, not? the <laughs> only one that actually knows of the question, there are only two people who actually know what the questions are. <laughs> Did I see them? I don't think I saw the question. I saw like one question. 
<laughs> oh, <laughs> the you know, you gotta look at some images soon. Uh, very quickly, you... um, sorry, um, but very quickly, if you guys missed the opening ceremony, I just published the video on YouTube, so uh, you can go take a look at the link is in the Discord chat general. So, Ooh. yeah, oh, thanks, thanks. I'm send it to my friend. Hello, someone missed it. Uh. <laughs> I love the United Newbies banner. <laughs> Ah, uh, thank you. We should probably start now. Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna do the little mini spiel again. <laughs> and then we're gonna get started soon. So, basically, you're gonna go to www.kahoot.it And then you gotta put in this pin, which is 8279153. One person from each team will actually enter the answers in order and the team with the most points will get Uber, I mean, not Uber, office works vouchers for each person. Um, yeah, but you've got to be careful because all of these are very quick. So you got, so you get most points for being the most correct and the most quick as well. So shall we get started? Okay. Good luck, y'all. All right. In that case, I will get started unless anyone has any objections. <laughs> if you have any objections, please message right now. <laughs> Objection. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> so does that mean one you more minute? Then? <laughs> <laughs> All I right. <laughs> There's team eight, Alex, Alex, and Alex. <laughs> All right, okay. In that case, I will get started. So, team Pia Green Kahoot. And I promise it will be a hoot. What was the code name for the first IBM personal computer? And I apologize for the typo up here. I did not notice that until now. <laughs> okay, we've got two answers going. Your answers? It's obviously Lisa. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> no, it was Acorn. God darn it. That was Apple. <laughs> <laughs> Funny you should say that. Oh, so, you know, newbies are ahead. Next one. Space Impact was a game developed by, is it Nokia, Motorola, Microsoft, or Nintendo? Actually, were most of you born when the Space Impact was developed? I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> I might be showing my age here. <laughs> Y'all oldies. Excuse me, don't give me that sass. <laughs> yes, boomer. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Nokia. All right. So I'm not that old. <laughs> <laughs> it used to be fun. We had this like little, like black and white game. Thanks, nostalgia. Oh, and I knew these are still there. All right. Next question. Have you been paying attention? Because it, what is the theme of Hack Vision? Time travel. I'm sure it's time travel. I wish it was time travel. <laughs> <laughs> like, do I look like the doctor to you? <laughs> <laughs> Marty McFly. Fly? No, I can't fly. Are Vanessa. What are you talking about? <laughs> I chicken to choose time travel. <laughs> Envision the future. Congratulations. 
at least you've got some idea of what to do now. <laughs> Come on, let me click next. Woo. Oh, wow, Team 80 is on Team fire. He just came out of nowhere. <laughs> Damn. Three correct and answers are wrong. Nice. So, I promise you, I'm not old enough to remember this. <laughs> so, is it a tape recorder, an 8-track tape, a battery, or a gaming cartridge? What in the world? Is that? I don't know. <laughs> or do I? <laughs> you made the quiz, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm just being sassy. It's an eight-track tape. It's very much an American thing, where you have eight, um, eight songs on a track. Yeah. Okay. But now with Spotify, you could do like thousands of songs instead of just eight. All right, next Goodness, question. How the time is gone. Yeah. Who is the 2021 Australian of the Year? Kangaroos. Duh. Just That's in 2021? It. I mean, that would be a little bit, um, you know, <laughs> you could say they've been around since forever, basically. <laughs> Bonus point. Why is she Australian of the Year? Mm, I should have done that. <laughs> for everyone that's just joined, I'm sorry, I've already started the Kahoot. Um, but you can watch just for the entertainment ba banter. So it was Grace Tame. Um, Grace Tame was Australian of the Year because there has been instrumental in trying to advocate for um, some laws which had prevented victims of domestic abuse from being able to share testimony um, or actually, you know, publish that they publish testimony in uh, the media. So next, sorry, my pop-ups are messing with me. United Newbies are very much on united fire. and on fire. <laughs> Okay, did you actually pay attention to the opening ceremony? <laughs> I don't because remember. Because who are the organizers of Hackvision? GDSC, oh, RMIT, yes. RMIT Switch, all the programmer. Oh, okay, yes, all of you have been paying attention. Good, that is very good. Hashtag Craig goes where? <laughs> Craig goes what? <laughs> I don't even know. <laughs> all right. Oh, okay, teammate, it's quite close. Well, we got any newbies ahead. So, next. Who is the event of Ruby? I would like to like for you all to know that a Ruby is a gemstone. <laughs> so the inventor for... should be the Earth. <laughs> is it Ayaka Miyagi? Yindi Wong? Oh no. Okay. That wasn't as obscure as I thought it was. <laughs> Either that or you got some awesome Googling skills. <laughs> it is Yukihiro Matsumoto. Moto. You know, newbie is 6,448. But teammate is catching up. Oh, yes. Now, since we're open to our diversity, name an LGBTIQA plus person in technology out of the following. Ada Lovelace, Sophie Wilson, Victor Chang, or Hedy Lamar. I am so uneducated. Damn. I have no idea. Yep, guessing. Sophie Wilson. <laughs> so Sophie Wilson is a transgender a transgender person. As an English uh, computer scientist, and who helped design the BBC micro and ARM architecture. Um, yeah. Wow, right. so cool. Yeah, pretty cool. Check out the Wikipedia page. <laughs> so I'll just put that in the chat if you, anyone's curious. <laughs> Again, I've found too many pop ups from this hack hackathon, but anyway. Woo! 
We have United newbies. That's 7,000 team mate is getting there. It's quite close. Uh, yeah. Go team. Go team. <laughs> I want to see if like the Packers just come out of nowhere. All okay, right. This is really ancient, but what is the acronym of the first ever computer in Australia? Is it Sil C S R A C M K plus one, Osco, Silac, or Corn? We can make a corny joke it, if it was corn. Hey. Charm, stop giving the answers away. <laughs> Wait, seriously? Ah. No, You're I'm just... messing with everybody. That is what I'm supposed to be doing. <laughs> For everyone that's just joined, you can just enjoy the banter because I've already started the um, game. But anyway. United Newbie, 8,000 teammates heading up. I'm and United Newbies has the highest answer streak of nine, which is impressive. All right. I would love your opinion on this. Which <laughs> is the most voted question on Stack Overflow? Is it, how do I undo Git ad before commit? Why does HTML think Chuck Norris is a color? For each array, array in JavaScript, or why is processing a sorted array faster than processing an unsorted array? I mean, the number of times I went from for Stack Overflow instead of legit documentation, isn't it? Oh, okay. That's an interesting one. Yep. Uh, I think a number of people would have like had something like this for like an assignment and probably just tried to Stack Overflow it. So, yeah. 8994. What is Dr. Allison Harcourt known for? Is it 2019 Senior Victorian Australian of the Year? Quantifying poverty in Australia? Optimizing algorithms for MP heart problems? Or just everything? Mm. Or as the name suggests, in the court as a judge or something. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were going for like a tennis reference. Yes, she actually did all of the above, which is amazing. Um, yeah, she's one of the famous uh, data analytics people uh, back in the early days. Um, yeah. Awesome data science, which is where I'm from. <laughs> <laughs> you know, newbies are still ahead. Okay. 13 out of 20. I really want to see what people think. Which one is not a programming language? Just ignore the cat with like the Starbucks coffee. Is it Haskell? BCPL? ASNB? Or regional assembly language. I feel like I'm going to be this cat at some point with the amount of coffee I drink. Nice. Okay. Thank goodness. <laughs> ASND is an acronym I completely made up. <laughs> Although one of our organizers, Sam. Um, is a lover of Haskell and functional programming. So I was wondering if anyone would actually vote for Haskell instead. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, I know you didn't leave, but Pewter Data has the answer streak of 11. Very consistent. Nice. Now, how many females were awarded the Nobel Prize for Chemistry? Is it three, seven, eighteen, or nine? Actually, 18. I kind of. I think I nearly failed chemistry in my university days. I don't know how you guys went. I didn't even do uh, chemistry in those. <laughs> oh yeah, true. Most of you are tech guys. I. Seven. Ooh, correct. Seven is the lucky number. Am I right? Yeah. But hopefully, in the near future, a lot more than just seven. <laughs> Ooh, where are Pewter Data is hitting it with 12 correct answers in a row. You know, newbies are in the lead. All right. Who created the first computer compiler? I promise you, it's not the cat. <laughs> but I love the cat, so uh, the cat gets credit too. Yeah. <laughs> 
Grace Hopper, Charles Babbage, Alan Turing, or Ada Lovelace? I feel like this cat will be like most of you at some point in the next 24 hours. <laughs> I knew Grace Hopper was hopping to it. <laughs> I'm just gonna stop. <laughs> yeah. But I won't. Oh, chum, 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 chum. I didn't know this, but Vanessa actually figured this out. So, you know, newbies are back in the correct answer streak with three in a row. Which of the following is it not an MSDOS game? Actually, what is an MSDOS game? I think Vanessa made this question up. <laughs> yes, I did. I just love how, like, the person's just, like, doing on the nose. <laughs> Diablo. <laughs> I'm not really much of a gamer, so Vanessa, you can give us like some facts if you want to. Um, yeah, so MSCOS, um, if you guys know, is an operating so system that came before like Microsoft XP, Windows 7 that we know today. And yeah. Awesome. I did not know that. I didn't make all of these questions, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> you yeah. did make most of them, though. Uh, yeah, this one, I, I'm not really much of a gamer, so credit to Vanessa. Uh, yeah, newbies are ahead. Who is the main celebrity of Hackvision? Me. Hey, I thought it was oh, me. My child. Oh, my <laughs> God. My name is Dare. Yeah. My name is Dare. Nah, -uh. my child. <laughs> Which you coded, but still. For some context, the GD, there are some bots around. <laughs> so many bots around. Yeah. We have what? too many bots. Hacker forward, yes. Oh, there's some people from GDSD, um, Discord will we'll recognize Lucky Charm as the greeter, Sudo Millie as the announcer. I wonder when I'm going to get my own bot. But I'm Something really soon. When I have free time, I will make you a bot, Steph. Thank you. <laughs> it's probably going to be called here, Steph. We can have her name as uh, No Nonsense Steph. <laughs> as in yeah, movies are in the lead. The Maybe they could win their own bot. <laughs> <laughs> Who created the no. first programming language? We shall bow down to this person. No, the great we shall. Hopper. We shall not. Tim Berners-Lee, John Van Numeren, or Ada Lovelace? Oh, it's a last minute answer. Oh, this is pretty split. The mother of programming is Ada Lovelace, who worked with Charles Babbage to create the first calculator. <gasps> Oh, hey, hey, like this. <laughs> I bet she has a like cult or something. <laughs> I wouldn't say cult, but she's very famous. Rightly so. So, so yeah, I knew he was in the lead. And an answer streak of six, they are on fire. What is ski free? What is, is not ski free? A game stock, an old Windows game, or an old Macintosh game? I bet the picture is like not good. Well, I made the pictures for entertainment and distraction. It's misleading, isn't it? Yes, it's an old Windows game. Uh, one of my friends used to really love playing this. I... Okay. Okay, you know, newbies are in the lead and yes, yeah, still on fire. So, last question. What was the first Apple computer called? Is it Macintosh, Apple One, the Apple, or Apple Lisa? But it's Apple One. <laughs> They've been kind of uncreative these days. Well, Apple well, well, Apple was created quite a while ago. Ah! Uh, oh my God! I was right. Apple yes. One, very uncreative. <laughs> Ironically for Apple, but yes. 
So, drum roll. Thank you. Thank you. I did not make my own sound effects or something, but anyway. <laughs> Team Building Company, Future Data is in third. Woo! Second team is Team H. First team is. United, United Newbies! Woohoo! Rats. Also, in a special mention to Packers and the Eternals. So, Charm, um, in terms of them getting their uh, office work vouchers, we already have their emails, right? Yes, they have sent me their emails. Okay. We if will you get haven't sent me your email, send it to me now. Yes. Um, United Newbies, please send Charm your emails so that we can get some offer, uh, office work vouchers to you uh, soon. Uh, yes, Charm, you've got them all. Okay. Yay. All right. Congratulations. Woo. Congratulations. Thank you so much. That was so stressful. <laughs> I love the new name, United Professionals. <laughs> 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 we will, well, well, if this is your get your team building cohort game, I want to see your hacking games right soon. Oh, Indeed. This is, this is... <laughs> We're just we're a cahoot focused. That's a whole right? different story because two of our um <laughs> members are still yet to come. Yeah. <laughs> oh really? Huh. Yeah. Uh no, so we we're all we all join this hackathon because we're cahoot specialists. That's our main skill set. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and we, we don't know anything about computer science, programming, design. No, no we really I think, two, I think only like uh the two the the members are there they're here right now. Uh me and Aisha, they're, we're the like, we're the ones with technical knowledge. Of, uh, another one's coming like soon. Uh, Liam. Liam, Aisha, and me. Oh, oh uh, yeah, Liam just says basic. Sorry, we're talking over the group. Yeah. Okay. Uh, there is a workshop going on right now if you are interested in it. Um, yeah, by the... Sam Nolan. Ideation workshop and agile scrum. If you'd like, you can attend that and get oh, some nice. ideas. 